Uh, what do you think, Nick? And uh, we know Houston, you just talked about how good they are. So no. uh, they're the cream of the crop in the West, maybe all of baseball. Who's the second best team yeah, well, in the West? I, I think 10 in a row. I mean, <laughs> I mean it's got to be the Oakland A's right now, exactly where they're at. Uh, these guys know exactly who they are. Billy Bean knows who his team is. He knows his payroll. He knows he's not going to be bringing over high-powered, you know, stars, getting paid a whole lot of money right now. It's the same as it was when I was there as it is right now. These dudes do everything great. They, they don't do anything great, but they do everything well. They're right. a team that kind of plays together. And think about it right now. Put it in perspective. They have the same amount of wins as the Boston Red Sox do right now. Uh, I mean, you can't sleep on Texas offenses. That They have Oakland in batting average, home runs, mm -hmm. and team doubles. The only thing that concerns me is who's going to fill in for the rotation for right. the Texas exactly. Rangers. They can continue to pitch down the season and stay in that race. I love what Miner has turned into, especially being the ace, the veteran ace. Mm -hmm. Lance Lynn has looked solid. But after that, it's going to be tough, especially pitching in Arlington where the ball flies out of the ballpark. So what does the back of the rotation and the bullpen do? I don't think they're going to be there in the right. end. I love the A's defense, and the A's can score runs with anybody anyway. Yeah, so. you know come August, it gets hot, and it kind of wears and, down on guys. And you know where I'm from. I got to go with the home team one time, home town. You know <laughs> <I'm from>. <laughs> <laughs> and, and disappointing that, you know, Mike Trout, best player in baseball, is not on a contending team once again with the Angels. At least it appears that we way. We knew that, though. And we'll be missing <laughs> him that. further. <laughs> yeah, but you were hoping that maybe they could hang around yeah, for I a agree. wild card or something. But they've had pitch problems for uh, for years the Angels have. Kiermaier has made a living off these catches, so let's look at some of the other catchers of the year, the candidates. Lorenzo Cain, Cain. closing out the Brewers' victory against the Cardinals. That was on opening day. Byron Buxton to the wall. Christian Stewart of the Tigers got oh. robbed here. Wow, you see that movement? Wow. Ex-Blue Jay, Kevin Pillar now with the Giants here. Nick Zenzel. Oh, that's cold blood. Oh, he had a homer. He climbed the wall and took it away from Senzel. Ramon Laureano. Joey Votto thought he had a homer. And Mike Fires kept the no-hitter intact and got it because of that grab. And Jackie Bradley Jr. Over the wall here. It's like he was on a Southwest flight. Give me that. He made that look too it. easy. That's too easy. I ain't never seen you do nothing like that. No, Josh, what? You kidding me? <laughs> Josh Reddick, this would have been a go-ahead three-run homer in the ninth, but he takes it away from Hunter Pence. He brought that out of the All right, so like what, like what do you think? If we have, they're all great. That's a terrific baseball. Defense underrated. When we sit and watch, we take it for granted. Which one with Kiermaier in that mix would you put at the top? Oh, man. That's a lot of good catches. You like the Loreano grab. Yeah, I like yeah. the Loreano catch only because it saved that no hitter. And normally in a no hitter, there's always that one pressure. tremendous play that kind of comes out. And I think, you know, Ramon has been doing this the second time he's done that. I mean, the kid is absolute cannon out there, right. really kind of making a name for himself on the defensive side. Jackie Bradley Jr. has continued to make a name of himself for being an outfield, one of the best outfielders in all of baseball. He's fun to watch. He makes it look so casual. I mean, it, look, there's a lot of goals sprinkled around that outfield. In Boston. <laughs> they save a lot of runs because of the athleticism of Jackie Bradley and Mookie Betts, Ben Attendee, but he is the guy in the middle of that field that makes it easy. He can cover a lot of ground. Really, really proud of this. Yeah, and anytime a guy goes, you play the up over a wall yeah. to, to well, make not a only catch. That, and... Even just the balance, the timing, so many things have to go right on that. You got to remember, these guys are running full speed into the wall. I would let timing it go. their steps, the whole <laughs> night, making sure they get a spike in the wall, get themselves over the wall, make the catch, pause a little bit. Take your picture, right? And then bring it back over, <laughs> yeah. you know? It's it's really it's a fun, fun part of the game.